The local arm of Global Road Safety Week, which is being observed from May 6th to the 12th, was launched on Monday. The week's activities are championed by thousands of road safety advocates around the world. It was opened by the Ministry of Works and Transport in partnership with Arrive Alive and the Trinidad and Tobago Police Service. Themed hashtag Speak Up for Road Safety, this year's agenda will focus on pedestrian road safety in Trinidad and Tobago, where the public will be engaged and educated on pedestrian best practices. Arrive Alive President Sharon Inglefield said too many lives are being lost on the nation's roadways. We respect these vulnerable road users and the drivers check their behavior and we want to make sure that the pedestrians and the pedal cyclists are accountable for their own safety, wearing something bright, pedestrians looking right, left, right again before they cross your road, pedal cyclists wearing helmets, please wear helmets, get someone to help you, sponsor a helmet, too many pedal cyclists are losing their lives in TNT. Minister of Works and Transport Rohan Sinanan said there are programs for the upgrade of the road infrastructure, which includes crossovers. Uh, this year we launched three. We have three actually ongoing as we speak, and we have, I think, two more to, to be launched before the, the completion of this financial year. And as Ms. Ingerfield said, we really look forward to, for the, the, the pedestrians to use them. Too often we spend the money on putting in this infrastructure and we still see people running across the highway. Although data put forward by the TTPS indicated that the road fatality rate recorded in 2018 was the lowest since 1958, the current road fatality rate for 2019 has surpassed last year's figure by 25%. Minister Sinanan said road safety can only be achieved if citizens take responsibility for their own actions. There are too much drivers on the road, there are too much um, cyclists, there are too much pedestrians who are just not respecting the laws of the land. And if we all take responsibility for our action, I am sure one day we can reach the zero, which is the target that we have set ourselves.